Hi, Palmer families. Happy Monday and welcome to our second week of our spring term. Um, I'm sharing this video today because I have a really exciting announcement for a special project that we're doing as a school and I'm really excited to share it with you. So let me just share my screen. You have probably seen this in the newsletter from last week, but to celebrate World Book Day 2021, um, since we can't all be together and be doing all those wonderful activities that we like to do this week, we thought it'd be really nice to kind of combine that idea of World Book Week and also um, getting a community project started for us since we're coming together as a school again after so long for being away from each other. So we're going to start with a community garden project and we have, we're asking families for their help to put this together. So right outside the reception area where Miss Spink's office is, is a really beautiful flower bed, um, but there's not much in it. So what we really like to do is we're going to kind of spruce it up and get some nice new spring flowers in there. But we also thought we really love to turn it into a character garden. So we're asking families at home, if you want to, it's completely voluntary, um, but we'd really appreciate your help if you want to work on a special project with us this week. So you will need a wooden spoon from home and some things to help you decorate that wooden spoon with to help us with this project. So we're looking to create a character garden. So any character from your favorite book, your favorite character, um, and we've got lots of ideas for you that I'll share as well. Um, you can create your own very own wooden spoon character. And if you can bring it into the school and give it to Mrs. Binks in reception, then we'd be really happy to add it to our garden. So what we'd love to see after this week is that we have loads of different characters and we can pop them all in our garden and make it look really beautiful with all of our creations. So I have some lovely examples um, of some characters that have been made with wooden spoons already. So you can see right on my screen, we've got the beautiful cast of the Gruffalo. Um, and I think this is all done with just a little bit of um, foam and paint. So really creative. We have this lovely family and you can see they've used um, yarn like string and material and pipe cleaner to and belt tips to make there. So you don't have to have paint at home. You can find a different way to make these characters. We have some lovely characters that have been made through painting and using paper. And finally, we have a great cast of animals as well, all made with wooden spoons. So if you would like to join us in this project, we really hope you will. You can decorate your wooden spoon character and you can give it to Mrs. Banks. Um, you can drop it off this week sometime in the office or you can bring it with you when you come back to school on Monday. And we'll be really, really excited to see you and to see what you come up with. And I know we can make a really special, wonderful community character garden. So have a think about who your favorite characters are from your favorite books and how you can maybe be really creative and make that into a lovely spoon character at home. And we can't wait to see what you come up with and we can't wait to share it all together. So thank you very, very much. Um, please join us. And if you have any questions, just give the school a little ring and I'll be happy to answer them. But yeah, it's not mandatory. It is voluntary, but we'd love to have you involved. So um, please help us. Thanks. Bye.